In this video, I'm going to discuss the surgical treatment options after a diagnosis of breast cancer and discuss how to decide between undergoing a lumpectomy compared to a total mastectomy. The decision to pick one surgery or the other is a personal decision. Some people want to retain the normal breast and some people do not want to have any breast tissue at all. A lumpectomy is removal of the tumor in the breast while trying to preserve as much of the normal breast as one can. In a lumpectomy, there needs to be radiation to the breast tissue after the lumpectomy is done. That helps prevent cancer from coming back into the breast. A lumpectomy is done if the normal breast can be preserved. However, there are some situations when a lumpectomy is not an option because the tumor is too large or it's located in an area that will not give a good cosmetic result after surgery. A total mastectomy is complete removal of the breast, so there is not any breast tissue left behind or very minimal breast tissue. In a mastectomy, radiation is generally not needed except in certain situations. In a mastectomy, an annual mammogram is not required. Even if someone has reconstruction, such as with an implant, a mammogram is not necessary. In deciding between a lumpectomy and total mastectomy for the surgical treatment of breast cancer, both procedures are equally effective. So talk with your doctor about which procedure is right for you.